I'm gonna pretend I'm getting married again. Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> this is how you do it, Asian style, right? You sit there, obviously with a suit on, not like this, right? And this is how it is. And it be, would be ideal if you had a bride with you as well. <laughs> anyway, let's get back to eating. Welcome to Kashmiri Karai over in Slough on the just off the Bath Road. This place is unbelievable. I've got to show you around. Let's go. 20 minutes from London, 20 minutes away from Reading, and you come to this spectacular building now the building looks good right but is the food any good it's time to find out this is Imran and this is your official BD review Gonna be dark outside, right? But let me show you this. There's a lovely balcony on the front of this restaurant. Look at this. Now I do know, right, that these guys do some uh, weddings and functions and what have you not. If you're having your wedding done, right, this is a this is a place where there, there will be a lot of opportunities for guys. I'm out trying to discover new food places. Do not forget to hit the like, subscribe, and the bell icon. Here comes the rest of your video photos and it's a wow factor okay so they do that and they also have a cafe that serves a breakfast at the rear of this building and that's only during the day it looks like a horror show with this lighting going on but this balcony pretty cool really different Time to order. So, this is a traditional, right? Understand this. It's a traditional place where you come for Kashmiri food, so it's hardcore Pakistani food, right? So, we gone for a mixed grill, we gone for chicken on the bone, karai, we gone for a selection of rotis and naans, and what else have we gone for? And we gone for a dal lentil curry, and this is actually dal marsh. Proust in the pudding, wish me luck. Let's do this. Got some kitchen action over at Kashmir Karai that don't let anybody into the kitchen. But well, we've got some background action. How are you? How are you? It's a busy kitchen. Let's have a look at this. How are you, sir? You okay? Yeah, okay. What is it that you're doing? Tandoor. Tandoor. Oh, wow. yeah, tandoor. This is the tandoor, right? And what is it that you're doing? Start. You're making the start. Yeah, start. I've been joined by the main guy himself. This is Brother Nasser. Nasser, how are you? So, I'm hiding in your heart, yeah? Okay. We're going for our speciality, uh -huh. which is black pepper chicken. Black pepper chicken. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Also known as jutsi karai. Okay. Yeah. And inshallah, you'll see you'll see the mind blowing taste. What's the difference between Pakistani food and Kashmiri food? A lot of different. There's a lot of different Pakistani food. Okay. And more authentic, more fresh ingredients. Right. And you know, alhamdulillah, you know, it's cooked with a lot of love. Inshallah, you'll see. Okay. Right. Here's a wedding hall. So if you fancy getting married and doing it in style, right? Up to 100 people they can hold. You must check with the restaurant though, because of COVID, I think it's only 50 at the moment. But if you want to wow your uh, your guests, right? Perfect background for social media, for photograph, the whole lot. I'm going to pretend I'm getting married again, hold on. Yeah. <laughs> this is how you do it, Asian style, right? You sit there, obviously with a suit on, not like this, right? And this is how it is. And it be, would be ideal if you had a bride with you as well. <laughs> anyway, let's get back to eating.
was pretty quick. Check this out. This is the mixed grill. Normally, right, when you go into restaurants, they give you the mixed grill on a hot sizzler. But this is hot as it is. Uh, this is the chicken, tandoori chicken. Oh wow. Oh wow. It's so nice and so well marinated. Lamb chop. Let's see if they got this right. Oh, wow, the duty paste on this is so good. Mm. Look at this. It's a fish. Let's try the fish. Mm. So crispy. And so soft in the inside, but the battery itself, it's so this is so Kashmiri, it's got a little kick to it, it's not bland at all because fish can be really bland. Ah. Mm. Let me show you this. Oh wow, the marination looks really nice. The wings can be really boring, right? Let's try this. Mm. I mean the mixed grill. What a start. This place is not just a pretty building. This is good food. Literally five minutes for the barbecue starters and then five minutes later the mains no messing about. This is pretty fast service and the restaurant our customers in there. So let me show you in. Have a look at this. This is the dal marsh, okay? Beautifully presented with some coriander. And then this is the black pepper chicken, also known as chersi karai, a specialty of the Kashmiri kitchen. And then we've got obviously the, the rotis and the butter naan. Oh, they look very fresh. I'm gonna go for the dal first. Let's put some of this in. What am I looking for in this? I'm looking for creaminess. I'm looking for the actual lentils, not to just melt in my mouth, but to stay a little bit hard, but not too hard. Mm. This is proper, traditional, home cooked food. This is what this is in a restaurant. Now, Right, if you know what I'm doing, then lentil curry, chapati, top it up with some onions, and if you're feeling brave, right, and then do this. Mm. Tomatoes in the, in the curry, ooh. Actually, that's hot. That's the heat going on, right? But quite typically, Kashmir would have a lot of the chilies because in Kashmir the weather is quite very, very cold. So they bring that custom back over here. Excellent on the actual dal itself. Let's try the big hu and ha about this black pepper chicken right on the bowl in pieces I mean look at that I'm gonna go I'm gonna try this one now with the naan instead of the roti oh that's the difference their naan is quite very very thin normally you get naan which are quite thick but these are quite thin let's let's go in without further ado Got that down to the tea. Wow. It's a really good grind. And the masala coming through. Oh wow. That is a tasty, tasty chicken. Really good. Again, following the whole sort of same thing. 
as a mental curry. The taste is it. I'm not sitting in a restaurant. It's a proper home cooked Pakistani food. This is what this is. Right, compliments to the chef. They sent me over the aloo wala paratha. So it's like a naan bread for everybody that doesn't know, filled with potatoes. And they said, Imran, what are you doing? You gotta try this. Oh, so hot. I'm gonna dip it in to the green chutney. Right? Get back in here. This is not your everyday paratha. It's very different. Look at the color of it. It's so fluffy. It's so lightweight. It's not very heavy. All right? Let's have a look at the insides. The actual mixture inside there has got a kick to it as well, so it's not bland. Oh, I'm gonna do that again. It's definitely a different paratha. Thank you, Chef. It was definitely a good solution. That has been Kashmiri Karai in Slough. I think it's safe to say I'm absolutely stuffed. Let's start with what we had first of all. Um, we had the mixed platter, right? Oh, absolutely mind blowing. Do not come to this place if you're not going to order the mixed platter. Wow, the mixed platter was just unbelievable. 10 out of 10, all the way. Uh, the, the marinations and everything, the, the, the kebabs, beautiful, really, really good food. Uh, then the black pepper chicken kadai, which is also known as Jersey kadai, the Kashmiri speciality, mm -hmm. top class marks, top class. Then the dal marsh, the, the, the chapatis, the naan, everything has been outstanding. The place is beautiful. Uh, it's an excellent backdrop for you know weddings, birthday parties, and what have you not. And it's really actually done inside as well. The restaurant itself, the staff are very friendly. Overall, this is what they're scoring. Mm -hmm. It's a good place. It's no nonsense Pakistani traditional food. And if that's what you want, and the price are very, very reasonable for where we are in Slough. So check these guys out. And as always, carry on watching the Bearded Bros. Oh, that is serious.